Imagine a bottle cast into the cosmic ocean, not with a message on paper, but with a message crafted for the ages, meant to travel farther than any human ever could. Instead of ink and parchment, this message is a golden record, carefully etched with the sounds, music and images of Earth, a time capsule of our world, created to tell our story to the stars. This is the true story of Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, launched in 1977, now the farthest human-made objects in history. These spacecraft were designed to journey beyond the planets, carrying our message into the vastness of space. They are our silent ambassadors, carrying the hopes, dreams, and curiosity of a small blue world into the unknown, venturing where no one has gone before. These twin explorers have journeyed past the giant planets, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune, capturing breathtaking images and invaluable data, and now sail through the uncharted territory of interstellar space. Each faint signal they send is a precious postcard from the edge, a whisper across billions of kilometers, expanding our understanding of the universe and reminding us how far our reach can extend. The Voyagers are more than probes, they are our senses in the void, seeing storms swirling on Jupiter, the icy rings of Saturn, and the tilted mysterious world of Uranus, revealing wonders we had only imagined. They've crossed the invisible boundary separating our solar system from the galaxy beyond, becoming the first messengers from Earth to enter interstellar space. Their journey is a testament to human curiosity, ingenuity, and our relentless drive to explore the unknown, to seek answers beyond our home planet. The legacy of Voyager is not just in the data it sends back, but in the inspiration it provides for future generations, reminding us all that our quest for knowledge and connection is truly universal. The Voyager mission was born from a rare planetary alignment that happens only once every 176 years. This allowed the spacecraft to use gravity assists, slingshotting from one giant planet to the next. In 1977, Voyager 2 launched first, followed by Voyager 1 on a faster path. Their mission explored Jupiter and Saturn, revealing the Great Red Spot, volcanic Io, and Saturn's dazzling rings. Voyager 2 continued to Uranus and Neptune, discovering Uranus's tilted axis and Neptune's dark storms. In just over a decade the Voyagers turned distant points of light into vibrant, dynamic worlds. Their journey rewrote our textbooks and showed the solar system's true diversity. This grand tour was a triumph of human ingenuity and precise planning, and after the planets their greatest adventure into interstellar space was just beginning. Each Voyager carries a golden record, a time capsule meant to last a billion years, drifting through the vastness of space long after Earth itself may be gone. It's a greeting to any intelligent life that might find it, a carefully crafted snapshot of who we are, where we come from, and what we value as a species. Curated by Carl Sagan's team, the record holds 115 images, sounds of nature, greetings in 55 languages, and music from Bach to Chuck Berry. It's a collection that attempts to capture the diversity and wonder of life on Earth, from the laughter of children to the crash of ocean waves. Its cover is etched with instructions, using universal scientific language, mathematical diagrams and symbols designed to be understood by any advanced civilization, no matter how different from us. The odds of it being found are tiny, almost unimaginably small, but that's not the point of this cosmic message in a bottle. Creating the record made us reflect on what it means to be human, and what legacy we wish to leave behind for the universe to discover. What images, sounds and music best represent all of humanity? What stories would we want to tell about ourselves if given only one chance? The golden record is a symbol of hope and optimism, a declaration that we can reach beyond ourselves, and that our curiosity and creativity are worth sharing with the cosmos. Despite our flaws and differences we sent a message of peace and friendship into the cosmos, hoping that whoever finds it will understand our wish for connection. It's a testament to our desire to connect, to be known, and to reach out, even across the unimaginable distances between the stars. To truly understand the Voyager's incredible journey, we must first get to know the vast and mysterious neighborhood they're leaving behind, a region shaped and protected by our sun. The sun is far more than just a source of light and warmth, it constantly blows a powerful stream of charged particles known as the solar wind, in all directions. This wind creates a vast invisible protective bubble around our solar system, called the heliosphere. The heliosphere acts as a shield, protecting us from harsh galactic radiation and cosmic rays that travel through the galaxy. 
It stretches far beyond the orbit of Neptune, enveloping all the planets in its embrace. But this protective bubble doesn't last forever. Eventually the solar wind collides with the interstellar wind, streams of particles blown out by distant exploded stars, creating a cosmic boundary. The first major boundary is called the termination shock, where the solar wind suddenly slows down as it pushes against the interstellar medium. Beyond this, in the turbulent region known as the heliosheath, the solar wind becomes chaotic and mixed. The very outer edge of this bubble is the heliopause. Here, the sun's influence finally fades and true interstellar space begins, an uncharted realm beyond the reach of our star. For decades the existence and location of this boundary were only a theory, debated and imagined by astronomers and scientists. The Voyager spacecraft were humanity's first explorers sent to measure, investigate and ultimately cross this mysterious frontier. As they traveled farther from the sun, the Voyagers weren't just leaving the familiar planets behind, they were venturing toward the very edge of the sun's kingdom, into the unknown. Their mission was bold and unprecedented, to journey beyond our solar system's final frontier, and to report back on what lies in the vast mysterious space between the stars. On August 25, 2012, Voyager 1 detected a sudden change. Fewer solar particles, more cosmic rays. It had crossed the heliopause, becoming the first human-made object in interstellar space. This was a historic leap, turning centuries of dreams into reality. Voyager 1 was now sampling the interstellar medium, sending back our first direct data from the galaxy beyond. In 2018, Voyager 2 followed, providing a second perspective and revealing the boundary's dynamic, shifting nature. The heliopause isn't a smooth wall, but a turbulent breathing frontier, crossing it marked humanity's first step beyond the sun's cradle. The Voyagers are now true interstellar travelers, carrying a piece of Earth into the Milky Way. Their journey reminds us of our potential to explore and understand our place in the cosmos. At the edge of the solar system the Voyagers found surprises no one expected. Instead of a smooth transition they discovered a chaotic, turbulent frontier. One shock was the Wall of Fire, a region of superheated plasma just inside the heliopause. The solar wind compressed against the interstellar medium created a cosmic traffic jam. Magnetic fields also defied predictions, remaining aligned with the sun's field even in interstellar space. The boundary was more like a shifting ocean surface than a solid wall. These discoveries forced scientists to rethink how our solar system interacts with the galaxy. The Voyagers revealed a wild, mysterious frontier, reminding us there's still much to learn. They turned the unknown edge of our solar system into a place of wonder and new questions. That the Voyagers still operate is a marvel of engineering. Built with 1970s technology, they've survived decades of radiation, cold, and cosmic isolation. Their power comes from nuclear batteries but every year, energy dwindles. Engineers have carefully shut down instruments to conserve power, extending the mission's life. Outside the heliosphere the Voyagers face intense cosmic rays, yet their robust design endures. They've taught us how to build spacecraft for the harshest environments. The data they send is vital for planning future interstellar missions. The Voyagers are our scouts, testing the unknown and paving the way for future explorers. Their survival is a victory of science and engineering offering a priceless roadmap for cosmic exploration. The Voyager missions are more than scientific triumphs. They're symbols of humanity's drive to explore. For decades these tiny spacecraft have inspired scientists, artists and dreamers alike. Even when their signals fade, they'll drift through the galaxy for millions of years, silent messengers of Earth. The golden records they carry are our final legacy, a testament to our existence. In 1990 Voyager 1 turned back to capture the pale blue dot, Earth as a tiny speck in the vastness. This image reminds us of our fragility and our shared responsibility to protect our home. The Voyager's faint signals are echoes of our curiosity, urging us to keep exploring. They prove that peaceful exploration can achieve the extraordinary. The Voyagers are vessels of the human spirit, sailing the interstellar sea. Their story will echo through the cosmos for ages to come.